there you can see the hole where the motor uh, goes in you can see the two holes where it is mounted the pulley goes right in here and there you have the bad idler wheel that is responsible for fast forward and rewind this idler wheel is really really bad and so this is the motor and as you can see this is the original pulley that is which is made of metal and as you can see I wound a lot of um, I think we call it duct tape um, here it is I wound a whole lot of that tape around the pulley and so that the 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 pulley is bigger as you can see I mounted the motor back into its place I put back the two screws that are holding the motor in its place so now we can try out the rewind and fast forward this is a view into the cassette compartment as you can see and I removed the head cover so you can see also the heads and now put it into fast forward to try out the improved motor man oh man that thing has a lot of speed now now rewind rewind will only work very short because of the auto stop man oh man huh that's great fast forward now I have a cassette loaded into the cassette compartment and now fast forward with a cassette man oh man it works it works it's noisy but it works it used to be noisy uh, ever since I, I have it it was always noisy but man oh man works great huh. rewind works not that good uh, fast forward again really really fast 